I want to show you how we can use automatic log analysis capabilities to detect attacks to our environment. In this case, a little over a million alerts have been generated in the last seven days, but only one of those is above level 12. Specifically, this one is a shell shock intrusion attempt. Let's take a look at it under the Discover section. We can apply these filters and we will be able to see all the details about this particular alert. For example, I can see what's the server affected by the attack, what is the IP address of the attacker, what is the role log or message that triggered the rule that generated the alert, where is this message located in the system, what is the CVE code for the vulnerability, and what is the PCI DSS control affected by the issue. I can also go to the manager section and see that right now we are using 1,826 rules to automatically identify attacks to our environment. In addition, we have 473 decoders that are able to identify the applications that are generating different type of log messages. If we click on the rules section, I can actually see the details of the rules, including the regular expressions that they apply in order to identify attacks. In addition, I can analyze the server affected by the issue, like in this case. I can see the operating system, the IP address, the host name, and what are the alerts that have been triggered over time, as well as what are the other alerts apart from the one that we already know about that are affecting this specific server. A lot of them are related to brute force attacks and some of them are related to web type of attacks. Another thing that's interesting is to take a look at the alerts that are related to the configuration of the server. Like, for example, there are known issues like uh, the hard disk is not using the right partitions or the suspicious files that have been detected in the system, specifically in slash step directory, or hardening requirements that are not met by the server. In addition, I can take a look at the PCI ESS dashboard and see what are the alerts that are affecting the different type of controls. In this case, the most repeated number of alerts are affecting control 10.2.5, which is related to authentication attempts. Then we have alerts affecting other controls like 10.2.6 or like um, 11.4 or 10.6.1 right here. For example, if we order them by count, I will be able to see that the shell shock attack is actually affecting control 11.4, which is related to the detection of intrusion attempts. Thank you very much for the attention.